Good evening, Mr. Martin. Good evening. How are you? Chewing on me nuts. No. Oh, which nuts? Show me. Oh, can you can you put place it down next to the pearls because I know you like them nuts. Oh yeah, these are the Aussie Natural Almonds from Aldi. That's it. So it's been a really cold week this week. Everyone's been whinging about it. Mmm, I know, eh? So we're having a midnight snack as a result. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we are trying Aldi's Emporium Selection Goat's Cheese Pearls. I've had this before. It's fantastic. It's fabulous. I've never tried them. They've got fig jam inside these. You know, it's like goat's cheese caviar with fig jam. It's that's how I would describe it. Just bigger than obviously caviar, but that's that to me feels like it. And um, they have um, those sticks. The sticky things. <laughs> They have sticks. <laughs> they have sticks. Toothpicks. So, so you don't, I'm sure there's a proper French word for it. Le, the French, <laughs> le, le, the toothpick. Okay, let's, let's not go there. So, so basically you, you do that to, um, to get the, um, the cheese out of the packet. Do you? So, yeah. Oh. So I think there's like three, six, nine, ten, twelve, maybe 15, 15 cheese pearls, which I'm sure we will demolish. It's only 75 grams. So we, we're having this, um, it's... The ones that we like, the crackers. The crackers. All right, shall you open? We'll have a look. Okay. Okay, well, maybe on the top, you know, we need to... Hang out. Okay, well, there we go. All right, so let's count how many there are. So, three, six, nine, fifteen. Can, can, can you show them your thumb as some... Okay, so it's as big as um, Mr. Martin's thumb. <laughs> <laughs> have a stick you know mr you know mr martin you know mimi will love this comparison all right so because you've never tasted it um how many how many i got four sticks okay all right well there's only two of us so i think this is what they call the picnic packet oh wait 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 wait, wait, wait. let me see okay which one are you choosing this one. Oh, okay all right all right okay you have it and let me know what you think Can you taste the fig inside? Oh, very strong fig. It actually overpowers the cheese. Well, look, I, I love goat's cheese. Um, this actually, the fig inside actually, it's like a big, big thing of jam stuffed inside a yogurt. Yeah. Oh, say so it's more yogurty, isn't it? Yeah, have a taste. Yeah. But the, mm. the, the, jam, the, the fig inside actually mm. overpowers the cheese pretty bad. Look. This goat's cheese actually remind me a bit of um, Meredith um, goat's cheese, which is mm. a really lovely, subtle cheese we've had. Obviously made. It's yeah. nice. It's really nice. But, but... You know, like people think of goat's cheese, especially the Brits. They look at goat's cheese and they think, oh my gosh, it has to be so... Um, it, usually it's very tarty. Tarty it's... and strong and, you know, because that's the Brits. They love strong smelling cheese. But... Goat's cheese doesn't necessarily have to be strong smelling. It can also be subtle and tasty like this one. This is this is actually quite nice, but I was actually a, not disappointed, but surprised that the taste is, um, I don't know, how would you put it? How would you put it? I know, she's gonna open one up. Mm. So we are going through this cheese. Mm. Remember, uh, we've done other cheese reviews before. Yeah, but that's what okay. we're talking about. Okay, hold on. Okay, let me just to focus on this camera. Can you can you move that oh, a bit a bit? Okay. Yeah. So as they say, you you've got a bit of fig there. Oh. The fig is actually quite strong, considering it's all cheese. Well, there is a big. You know, who would have thought you insert fig jam in cheese? But then again, you usually have cheese with all sorts of fruits. Yeah, true. But it is a subtle surprise compared to what I'm used to when you say goat cheese. What kind of goat cheese do you usually have? Goat cheese. What? Well, what kind of flavour, so to speak? Usually it's a harder cheese and the flavour is very... Strong. Oh, it's, it's got a, a scent yeah, the, of and the, taste. The mm. very taste of goat. Yeah, it I is. Mean, that's it's very thing. strong. This is what I like about this cheese and um, the Meredith one. They're young, 
the early. They haven't matured as yet. This is very, um, a very sweet taste. Mm. A really sweet taste. It's a good combo. Mm. Mm. Not bad for a midnight snack. True. Mm. It works quite well, actually. It's very nice. Mm. So now, now, now you get why I like it. Yeah, it's all right, mm -hmm. but we need more crackers. We need more cheese. Nah. I'm in all honesty. We've got five left. We might as well finish them now. Oh, definitely. Mm. So, look, I think this is good value. I'll um, find out how much it costs again from Aldi. Um, can you spear me one? I'm trying to hold this. I should get one of those holy thingies when I do these things. With the little lights as well. Uh, yeah, I know, but that will make me into pro. I'm not sure about that. Oh, anyway, mmm. It's delightful. But you definitely have, you can't put it on a cracker, but you chase it with a cracker. Mmm. It's too, um, really, I mean, it's 75 grams, but it, that's the thing about cheese. It's it's more substantial than, than it lies. Mmm. Okay. Last one for me. And you can have the last one. Sure. Mr. Martin. Mmm. Nice. And that's it. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen. Three, six, nine. Sorry, I'm, I'm counting there. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen. No, eighteen. Oh. Yeah. Um, oh. Wow. We've gone through it quickly. Hmm. Didn't realise it was such a pig for goat's cheese. Yeah, it just doesn't have that mm. aggressive, pungent taste. Okay, so shall we give it a rating out of five? I got four. It's really nice. Mm -hmm. It's Me very too. sweet. Very, very sweet. Me too. Four. Mm. Four and a half. Four and a half. Yeah. All right. So that's um the um Aldi the Aldi infused goat's cheese pearls, and I think we'll have it again. Mm. Mm. If it comes out with something else, it'd be different. What? I know something else rather than the fig. Oh, okay. True, true. All right. Mm. Bye for now. All right.